Welcome back to the final part of the Splunk Observability Cloud Onboarding Series. By now, you've completed setup and started implementing some key use cases. But Observability Cloud has a whole host of products within it. And in phase three, you'll learn how you can use them together to maximize their value. A good starting point is learning how to make a JavaScript web application observable end-to-end -end using Observability Cloud. First, you'll use Splunk Infrastructure Monitoring to understand your host metrics. Then, move over to Application Performance Monitoring to see how the microservices supporting the application are performing. And then finally, to Real User Monitoring to see how users are experiencing your application. Our products also work in tandem to greatly reduce unplanned downtime. Say you're an SRE who is investigating an error and you want to know whether it's a front-end or back-end issue. You can use Splunk, RUM, and APM together to easily run a front-end, back-end correlation to diagnose the problem and alert the correct team to fix it. The final phase of the Observability Onboarding Toolkit features video demos walking you through each of these two scenarios, as well as additional resources to assist you on your path to digital resilience, like more advanced training. Thanks for watching and happy Splunking!